We're going to make a classic Israeli salad. This salad is seen on every table, at just about every occasion, every meal. <laughs> Persian cucumbers, some tomatoes, some onion, a little bit of lemon, olive oil, and salt. If you don't have Persian cucumbers, that's fine, but they sure are good when you do. The number one key is to cut everything up really small. So let's get started. I'll show you what small is. Literally tiny little cubes or tiny little pieces because this is going to all mix up and it's really good when it's uh, so well mixed and it can only do that if the pieces are really small. I'm going to start with my onion. The sort of things that go in this are a little bit open for interpretation. I've always just had the cucumber tomato, a little bit of onion. Some people add parsley and uh, peppers to it, but you know, it's not hard and fast. So this is what we're looking for here. It's just a real small dice. There are some experts in the field who make these even smaller. <laughs> a sharp knife is a must. I'm gonna go ahead and cut these up. I really like these Persian cucumbers. I don't know, I don't see them around all year long, but maybe I'm just not looking. I got these at uh, Trader Joe's. And here's our fine diced cucumber. I'm gonna put that in the bowl. I'm just gonna put everything in there and mix it all up. And finally, our tomato. Not sure if one tomato is gonna be enough. We'll see how it goes. Here's the tomato, not as finely diced as a, an expert salad maker, but good enough. I think it really depends on the type of tomato you have. I just had some, I think they're slicing tomatoes. And I'm going to mix this up. And add a squeeze of lemon. Got a little lemon right here. I should have taken this lemon out earlier. They're best when they're not right out of the refrigerator. A little bit of olive oil, some salt. Mix it up and it's good to go. This size and this style of salad is just delicious. I especially like to stuff it in a pita bread with other Israeli type foods or Middle Eastern type foods like falafel or hummus or whatever. You can also put it in a wrap. The tiny size means that stuff stays put better, I think, than big chunks. So that's it. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching.